terms of being a parent now, uh, Sarah Milligan, you decided quite early uh, this was not for you. Yeah, I don't like kids. No offence. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure yours are lovely, but I'm glad they're not here. Um, <laughs> no interest at all. Um, <laughs> Yeah, I was on holiday, so we went on two holidays abroad when I was a kid, one at uh, Malta when I was four and Spain when I was eight. And when we were in Spain when I was eight, I was, um, uh, my present I got on holiday was a baby doll, but it was like this. It was <laughs> giant. <laughs> and I remember having an inkling then, what, like, what childbirth was. Like, I knew that it came out of a part of a woman, and I thought, no. <laughs> on me that would ever manage that. <laughs> and the fun thing about the baby doll was that it had, a, it had a dummy. You took the dummy out, the baby cried, put the dummy back in, baby stopped crying. Brilliant. Uh, one, this one particular night, um, you know, people, women often think that the day they became a woman was the day that their period started. Not for me. Um, on this one night, we lost the dummy, so the baby was constantly crying. <laughs> <laughs> and I was bitten on the nipple by a mosquito, <laughs> and it grew an actual boob. <laughs> so I think that's the night I became a woman. <laughs> because I, I was eight, but I wore a bra, and my baby would not shut the door. <laughs> <laughs> uh.